this video? It's probably because you're trying to buy Christmas presents for a man in your life and you're having a hard time. Men are hard to shop for and you ask them what they want for Christmas or their birthday or whatever and they say nothing or they say I don't know or they say beer, socks, underwear, like that's not a fun gift to give. I put together a list, I've been working on it for a while and I know that it's a good list because I've been posting little bits and pieces of it on TikTok and the feedback has been really good from both men and women. A lot of people have shopped this list for their the men in their lives for Christmas. And also a lot of men have commented on it and said that it was a good list and have also given suggestions and recommendations of things I should add to the list that other men have agreed with. So basically I've gotten a lot of feedback and I've really fine tuned this list. So I'm gonna go through the list and include pictures on screen so that you can see what it looks like and then every single thing that I mention will be linked in the description so you can shop it there. Most of this, if not everything, is Amazon. A lot of it you can buy other places, but I mean, prime shipping, they have usually the best deals. Also Black Friday and Cyber Monday are coming up and they always have really good deals on these types of things. All right, number one on my list are Ugg slippers like house shoe slippers. I know that might be a little weird. I know Uggs are super trendy with women. I'm literally wearing some right now and I wear them every single day. But I bought my boyfriend slippers before for Christmas a few years ago and they don't last very long. They wear out super fast, especially if you have to like walk outside for any reason, go check the mail, walk the dog, whatever, they do not last. But we got him some Uggs a few months ago and when I tell you he wears these things every single day, he is obsessed. We're an Ugg family now. We, we wear Uggs all the time. And they're a little bit over $100. He has the black ones. And when I shared the Uggs on TikTok about being a good gift, so many people wrote in the comments that their man, significant other has those slippers and also loves them and wears them all the time. But I also know not everyone is a fan of Uggs. Not everyone has $100 to buy slippers so i also have an amazon basics version that's a really good option it has great reviews it's good quality they look super similar and still a really good gift the second gift which has been a little controversial but i think it's still a really good gift and i've seen so many women buy this already from my amazon is a robe now most men if not like i would say I would say 95% of men are not gonna put a robe on their Christmas list. And when you say, what do you want for Christmas? They're not gonna say, I want a robe. But if you buy him a robe, he will wear the robe. I and so many other women that I know have had their own robes stolen by their men because they're cozy, they're nice, they're comfy. They wear them at home with the slippers all the time. Here I have one link that has a hood, which people have really seemed to love. They have a bunch of different colors. It's like fleece and soft and cozy. But if you're not a fan of the really fuzzy warm version, there's also like waffle knit, there's linen, there's a ton of other options. So I'll link one of those too. Kind of in the same category of like homeware are satiny pajamas. Another thing that your man is not gonna ask for are satiny pajamas, but there's this one brand on Amazon called like Sioro or something. I'll link these below too because they're my favorite pajamas. I have, I think six pair, all the different colors of the satiny pajama sets. They're so cute and so comfy and they just make me feel bougie. For a while, I was wanting to buy my boyfriend some because I just wanted to match because I thought it would be cute. And then I got him some and he really likes them. I got him the black pair, which I think is just like, probably the safest color to go with. He really likes them. I think I might get him some other colors just so he has more than one pair. 10 out of 10 recommend. They're so comfy and cozy and who doesn't like a little like luxurious self-care moment. Next on the list is this watch. Now I specifically picked this watch instead of like the Apple watches, the Garmin's, whatever. Obviously there are all these really incredible watches, but I feel like people have stopped wearing the fitness tracker watches in everyday life. Like a lot of people still do obviously, some people like have the nicer bands where they're gold or silver, whatever. But I think everyone needs just like a really nice elevated sleek watch. Like this is mine. It was literally like 30 bucks on Amazon. It's gold and silver so I can wear it with all my jewelry and I wear this every day just because I feel like it looks a little bit more elevated than like a fitness tracker watch. But I like this one specifically because it's all black. It looks really sleek. It has like a mix of matte black and shiny black and 
every man just needs a really nice watch and I think this is a good option that isn't too crazy expensive it's a little bit over $100 and it's still a nice brand and would definitely last a long time this is one of the best sellers from this list actually so many women have been buying this for their significant other for the holidays this one is a little unexpected and when you just look at it you really have no idea what it is it's a food dehydrator and the reason that I have this on here is because my boyfriend and I have been talking about buying this for a couple years now and I feel like it's just a manly thing to have. Like you can make all kinds of dried meats and beef jerky and turkey jerky and whatever. And I feel like it's one of those appliances that people don't really buy themselves as often. Like everyone has an instant pot, a pressure cooker, like coffee makers, kitchen aids. Like people tend to, to buy those for themselves. But people don't really have like food dehydrators. And I don't know, it's cool, I like it. I personally, want it so I can make dried mango and dried fruit uh, and beef jerky obviously beef jerky duh I'm pretty sure that this is already on an early Black Friday sale and it's like just a little over $100 so really good deal for what it is and I feel like this is something that you can have for a long time this is probably the most affordable thing on the list and I think it will probably be the best seller of all my Amazon things for the month of November because so many people have bought it for gifts for themselves. It's about $30 and it's a little charging slash dock station for your nightstand or your desk or your dresser, your closet, wherever you keep like your Apple Watch, your AirPods, your iPhone, and you wanna charge it. And I have this on here because personally, I know that my boyfriend has his Apple Watch and his phone and his headphone. Everything's like in different spots. Just being able to have it together in one little location where it charges all night and it looks really tidy on your nightstand is really great option. So this one's black, but they have some other options. And then others, there are other versions of this all over Amazon. Like you can definitely find one that works for you. There's wooden ones, there's ones that are bigger where you can put your wallet and your cards and your keys, your mail, like it goes, you can find really big ones and really small ones. Another super similar item that you could do is a men's jewelry box. Now, I don't mean like a jewelry box for a man who has like a ton of jewelry, which some men do and they probably need a jewelry box. But this one specifically I like because it really just has a bunch of compartments for all their different things. And it's under $100, so I feel like it's a good price. But this is something that maybe if he doesn't need that charger, he needs something bigger with more space. It has a little spot on top for your iPhone to charge at night, a spot for your wallet, a spot for the watches, a spot for whatever. I think this would be a nice way to organize all of his things because most men don't have something like this already, like a box to put all their nice things. I'm adding this next one in here as an honorary mention because this was the number one requested thing on my TikTok videos from men and it's Legos. Men just want Legos. My boyfriend says he just wants Legos. My comment section says they just want Legos. Men apparently love Legos. And I found a couple, there are obviously so many, but I just picked two that were pretty popular themes so i've got a marvel one and i've got a star wars one and like i said there are an abundance of options but i'm from what i saw and what i heard um the feedback said that if you got your man some legos that would just make him happy and you pretty much can't go wrong so pick a theme for something that he likes and maybe do it together unless he wants to do it on his own <laughs> whatever but legos this is actually something that I have. I have a different color, but I have this gift and I got it for Christmas last year and I have used it countless times and I still think it's a really good gift and something that people usually don't buy themselves. Right now for early Black Friday deals, it's only like $30, which is a really good deal, but it's a neck massager. But the reason that I like it is because it does the massage, it does the heat, it goes like in two different directions. So it goes this way and then it goes this way. And then it has these like pads that come down and it has a button here that you can kind of like control what it's doing. And I just love it. It's really like the way that it lays on your shoulders, you can just sit in a chair on the couch at your desk and have the little massager. And yeah, it's a good gift. Like this would also be a good gift for like your parents, your in-laws, your grandparents. Like this is a safe gift. Everyone loves a massage. This next thing is um a gift that honestly my boyfriend doesn't want but i've seen a lot of people buying it for their significant other and it's this little beard cape so they put it around their neck it sticks to the mirror and while they're shaving it collects all the hair 
So I don't know if this is technically a gift for him or for you, but it collects the hair. It's easy to dispose of it. There's not a mess. You're not gonna find beard hair um, on the bottom of your socks and it's a win-win. If he has interest in like home decor and a really elevated space, the first gift that I have here is a stone diffuser and I actually have this in our house and I have the white version and I think this black is so sleek and I specifically picked this one because the outside of it is ceramic and it has this like ceramic stone finish to it which makes it look so much more elevated and heavy than the diffusers that you find at like Target and Home Goods. A lot of the times those ones are kind of light and very plasticky and this is not. This specific style just makes it look really elevated and sleek. And then you can buy him a pack of essential oils that are maybe more woodsy or smoky, just more masculine scents. And he can put that in his office while he's working or while he's playing video games. And it just creates a really serene environment. And if he's not into diffusers or if that isn't in your budget, you could always just do a masculine candle. I know they have a ton, there's one here, but there's a bunch that are like leather scents and amber and woodsy. And so if he's the type of guy that likes to burn your candles, um, give him his own candles. <laughs> On my TikTok video, I got a lot of requests for more blue collar gifts. And so the next few are something that, they're not just blue collar, but I think they're pretty easy gifts that a lot of men would like. So this first one is a toolbox. I picked this one because it's black and it looks kind of sleek, but it's just a good way to organize the tools. I know that as you get older, usually when you, know, when you buy a home and things like that, you tend to accumulate more tools. And personally, I know we're to the point where we need a toolbox. Like we have a tool bag that is overflowing and drives me insane. Um, and I know that I'm not alone with that. So this is just a really good, sleek, organized way to consolidate everything and have it in one location. But it's also a really size-wise a big gift. And I know everyone likes a big gift. The second thing that's a little more blue collar friendly is a brewmate. So I have two on my list. One is for like beer can size and one is for bottles. And the reason that I put this here is because these things really do keep your beer or your drink whatever cold for so long. And so even if, even if he doesn't drink beer and he drinks canned drinks or white claws whatever whatever his pre preference is um there's a brewmate for for him and also you can get your own brewmate and you can get like different colors and you can both have them yours is pink his is black and there you go win win i never thought i'd be putting something carhartt branded on my gift guide but here we are Actually, I never thought that Ugg would be on my gift guide either. Anyway, Carhartt, as we all probably know, has definitely made a comeback. It not only made a comeback in like trendy ways, it's still really good quality clothing and outerwear and whatever. So I actually linked quite a few things, but I know that Carhartt is like tried and true, really good quality. Pretty much anyone can wear Carhartt branded things. So here I have some vests. I have this hoodie that has been a bestseller on my list. A lot of people have purchased this so far. They have a lot of different colors too. I know Carhartt hoodies are so good because they are really thick and heavy and good quality. And everyone loves like a heavyweight hoodie. Also, I do recommend buying him this hoodie and then stealing it because it's a good one. Honestly, I've been looking at Carhartt a lot recently to buy myself things because I do have the Carhartt beanie and they have some vests for women that I'm thinking if I get like the really big oversized one, it could be a really cute vibe. This next gift is something that I haven't seen anyone put on any men's gift guides yet. And it's a cornhole or bago set. So maybe you like going on beach trips. Maybe you like to invite friends and family over and host and grill out back. Like this is such a good gift to just like bring people together and play outdoor games. Even if you don't necessarily like this game or you already have it, you could always go for another game that's like outdoor themed just because I feel like everyone loves a little like get together and a little game of cornhole. I specifically like these ones because I know a lot of people build their own, which is great and you can customize them and paint them and everything, but then it's really hard to like travel with them. So this one comes with a bag, so you can just load it up in the car and head off to the beach and it's a really easy transition. Obviously, if you have seen my videos before, you know that I like Lululemon and my boyfriend also is obsessed with Lulu, but I know that not everyone has a budget that can buy a bunch of Lululemon stuff for Christmas. Like I'm definitely not gonna buy him a ton of Lulu. 
I'll buy him some, maybe. Uh, but there's a brand on Amazon called CRZ Yoga, and I personally love their stuff. I have some leggings, I have some tanks, I have some pullovers, and they all remind me of Lulu Fabrics and Fits, which is why I love them so much. But we've recently been trying out the men's clothes too to see if he can find some good options that are really similar to his Lululemons, but are like under $50. And we found these pants. He has the brown version here. I linked a couple of the different colors on my list. And the reason that I put these on here is because they're $40. They look so similar to a Lululemon pant. They feel similar, they're soft and stretchy, and they look really high quality, and the colors are really rich and beautiful. He really likes them, he is approved, so I feel like they were worthy enough to go on the list. It's also worth noting that they have different lengths. So if you're shopping for someone who's really tall, they probably have a length that will fit them as well. All right, not to get into a Yeti versus Stanley debate, I know it's a hot topic right now, but personally, I still love my Yeti the most, and my boyfriend also loves his Yeti. And so this is something that also could be really blue collar friendly, but like, hello, we all need water. We're all dehydrated. A Yeti is a great option. My boyfriend has the black one and I have the white one, and like, literally everyone in my family, we buy each other Yetis every single year. Every person pretty much gets a new Yeti every year for Christmas. Whether it's like the coffee mug, they have one that's like small. I'll put a picture. It's like small coffee mug. They have like the medium sized coffee or like warm drink one. It also would fit like a can of soda really easily. Um, we use that one a lot just to like, if we're gonna be walking around carrying it, we like the smaller one. And then obviously there's like the big tumbler, which we always have. And then you can also get the lid that has the straw in it already. So, and it doesn't spill like the Stanley's do. So anyway, Yeti is always a good option. Not only do they have good products to hold your drinks, they also have like lunch boxes. Obviously there's the Yeti cooler. I put this white one on the list because I think it's perfect for like a boat day or something. It's really good for maybe like two people. It's not something that you'd pack like a whole family picnic in, but it looks really sleek and cool. It's high quality, it lasts a very long time. It also holds its value really well because it's such good quality. We love Yeti. This one is a good stocking stuffer. If your man loses his keys, his wallet, his head sometimes, Air tags. These things are like lifesavers. I actually have them on my dog's collars as well, just to like make sure, you know, if my dogs get out or something, whatever. But you can get the, the little leather holders. They're just Bluetooth. They connect to whatever device is around. And it's an easy way for like, it's just an easy way for him to keep up with his things, honestly. And they make so many accessories these days where you can get like a wallet. I actually found one, a wallet with an Apple Air tag built in or a holder for it built in. You can get like full keychains with it on there. You can get purses that have it on there. Like they really have us taken care of with losing our things and having to track everything with an Apple AirTag. The next gift is something that I know that everyone would probably like. Not like men, women, old, young, mother-in-laws, grandparents, mm, maybe not grandparents. It's a little techie, so it depends on your grandparents you know, level of tech savviness, but Philips Hue lights, and I know Amazon has some too now, I think that are just, they have a different name, I'll link them too. We started buying the Philips Hue lights back in like 20, back in like 2019, and now we have them in almost every room of the house. We have, we love just laying in bed and just being able to say, hey, turn the lights off and they turn off or saying, hey, turn the lights red, they turn red. Something about that just feels really luxurious. But this is definitely something that you like build up on. You probably aren't gonna just buy all of them at one time, that's very expensive. But if you just start to buy little pieces, get them a few bulbs, you know, start learning them, start figuring out where you want them, and then over time, your whole house will just be the Philips Hue bulbs. And it's really fun, it's like a cool experience, especially if he has like a theater room or a gaming room where he can like go into his man cave, say hey Google, turn the lights green or blue, whatever, and then the whole room turns blue and he's like in his vibe and his element. And my boyfriend does that and he really loves it. So I feel like that's just a good gift. If you're shopping for someone who goes to the gym a lot or has sore muscles, maybe they have a really demanding job, you could get them a Theragun or like a muscle massage gun. Here's an example of one. I picked this one because I think it's a little bit more affordable than the full size ones. There's also a lot of different off brands, but this is just the main like original Theragun brand. 
And this is also a good gift for any women in your life who like to go to the gym and get sore muscles too. But let me tell you, these things work. They're kind of intense, but they work really well. Another gym lover option is head bumps. And there's a few different ones on my list because I feel like people are so particular about their headphones. My boyfriend has these Bose headphones and they have lasted since about 2019. He wears them probably every day. He works out in them. He works with them. He listens to music with them. Every time we go on a car ride, he's wearing them and they've lasted a long time. They're noise canceling. He loves them. Great option. If he likes the Bose brand, but you're shopping for something that's not over the ear, you could also do like an earbud, which I have linked as well. And then if he's like an Apple fanatic and he like only wants to have Apple products, obviously there are the big Air Max earphones that are super popular right now. They're definitely more expensive and a splurge, but still an option and a really good gift. If he's into music, but he doesn't already have a record player or a turntable, I think this is a really cool gift. The thing that drew me to it was it's just really pretty and it looks really modern and sometimes record players can look kind of plasticky and cheaply made and this one does not look like that at all. It actually looks like a piece of like decor which I really like and I put this on here because I think this is the kind of gift that gives you a hobby. So you can get this for him and then now you have reasons to go to record stores and Go to antique stores and thrift stores and look for vinyls and get into new music and discover new things and I just think this is like a really good gift to get someone who needs a new hobby or someone who has maybe all really likes music but has never really dove into like discovering new music. This one's a little bit over $200 so it's on the higher end but even if this isn't for you there are still going to be so many other options on Amazon and lower and higher end and whatever you're looking for. This is also something I did not think I would be talking about on YouTube. Or social media period and honestly this doesn't just this isn't just for men like I would appreciate this as well a good stocking stuffer is literally just beef jerky like I like this brand personally because it's individually wrapped so it lasts longer and it's not all just gonna go bad um, it's also grass-fed and it tastes really good but like if you gotta fill someone's stocking just put a bunch of beef jerky in there and like honestly you cannot go wrong they will be happy and the last thing on my list that I was shocked that people, men specifically, kept requesting in my TikTok comments was a sword. So, like I do, I found one on Amazon. This is $30, it's got a sheath, it looks manly. Obviously, hang this up, display it. This is like for decor, but so many men said they wanted a sword. They didn't say knife, they didn't say pocket knife, they didn't say utility knife. They said sword. So, here you go. Apparently, your man wants a sword. Anyway, if you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. I hope this was helpful. I really do. I think it will be. And I'm excited to hear what you bought and what they liked. And if you have any other ideas, definitely put them in the comments. I can keep making videos on TikTok. I'm probably not going to make another one here. But I'm going to keep doing men's gift guides on TikTok. So if you don't follow me there, go follow me on TikTok. Like I mentioned, I will link every single thing in the description. And I'm going to put it in the order of the video. Hopefully that will make it really easy to find. But this is my first gift guide of three. I'm going to do a gift guide for her and also a bestsellers gift guide for like anyone. So like this video and subscribe if you want to see the future gift guides. And I hope you have a really happy and merry and joyful holiday season.